My name's Andrew Peterson, I'm a drone dude, and this is our octocopter. So what we have right here, this is essentially a mashup of different components that we've found, stuff that we really like using, and so we've kind of mashed it all up into one big system, which we go out and do all our commercial work with. The camera payload right now is about 12 pounds. That's including the Movi, which is the, the three-axis gimbal you see here, along with this carbon fiber red camera, it's carbon fiber red dragon. It's super lightweight. It's designed for aerial cinematography. So they built the chassis, the whole frame, out of carbon fiber. And what that allows for is it just cuts down on weight, which is essential for what we do. And you know we're, we've been getting some awesome shots of this thing. It's just absolutely amazing. First it started off flying you know, DSLRs and smaller cameras like that and then we kind of upped the ante and wanted to get into the red game and that was always a dream of mine to be able to fly a red and so um, we started doing that on these uh, servo based gimbals back in the day and it was a total pain in the ass. It was constantly getting bumped and adjusted every time you landed it would kind of offset its balance and um, with the new, you know, three-axis brushless gimbals that we're using today with these new gimbals, it's just so seamless. You can kind of just forget about all the, uh, the, the tuning that, that would have gone into it and all the setup time, and it just works. And, um, you know, we're really stoked on that right now. But this system overall, this is just a mashup of different copter parts that we pulled off the shelf. And, um, kind of put together into our own kit and works for us. So This frame is actually built off of a Sinistar 8 frame. So it's, a, it's essentially a Sinistar, a modified Sinistar with boom clamps that kind of allow us to fold the copter up and transport it and travel really easily. Whereas before we were traveling with this big case, it would just fit into this big case. And now we're able to kind of collapse the whole system down. We've made certain improvements on the frame where we thought that, um, you know, it, it would benefit us, and um, yeah, it's just been um, it's been a really nice system to, to work with. It's exciting right now the, with everything going on with the FAA. I mean, it's it's just really exciting. We've got, you know, we've been hoping for this day to come for a long time. You know, we've we've always played by the rules. We've always, you know, followed the the certain protocols, keeping safety, you know, as our number one priority, and um, you know always been an advocate for safe flying and responsible flying so I think it's really good that the FAA is finally coming around to it and stepping up and coming forth with regulations that make sense and um, as a starting point for us to continue to expand upon I think it's a really great um, really great time right now.